Okay, so I'm just going to basically go down the centre of all these middle stripes with a little bit of silver. I've also let that middle dot dry and I've gone over that again just to make it more vibrant. So I'm using the tip of the pencil and I'm just popping those wee dots down there. We call this a colour drop when you start to layer other colours on top of others. It's a colour drop. So I'm just probably going to speed this part of the video up. So you can kind of see. Look at that. I won't bother. I'll just do it this way. Because once you get confident with your dotting, it's quite amazing how quickly you can do it. It's like anything else. You just get faster at it. I found it when I learned to do crochet. I just, at first it took me ages and then I was away. I guess knitting might be like that as well. I'm always really impressed with people that can knit really fast. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to put that silver away and I'm going to work with the pink now. And I'm just going to go down the sides of each of these stripes here and I'm going to do the same as I did with the silver. I'm going to start off with my smallest tool and then I'm going to change to this here. Okay, so I'll just show you that coming down the side of this purple stripe here. I'm just following it halfway and then I'm going to change to the bigger one. Checking my end. It's the best end. I think I'll just go bigger there. And I'll do the other side. I've gone bigger that side I'm just going to do it symmetrical and change to the bigger dot there and then I'm going to do it symmetrical and change to the bigger dot there okay I'm actually going to stop the video and I'm just going to finish this and then I'm going to let you see the final result okay, so I'll see you in a wee minute Okay, so I think you can see the, the effect there and it's still pretty wet, so I'm just going to let that dry and then once that's completely dry, what you would do is you would put a wee silver dot directly into the centre of the pink, but mine obviously it would just all go into a blob, so I'm not going to do that there. Okay, so that's the Sea Urchin Stone and I'm going to go on with the Spiral Galaxy Stone next. And I look forward to, to doing that with you. So happy dotting and I'll speak to you soon. Bye bye.